Awesome. All right, I have three questions wrapped in one, um, okay. and they they might all come together. Um, uh, the last time you were inspired, what is your inspiration, and who is your favorite artist? Oh man, artist as far as anything. Okay, uh, I would have to your say... creative mind and your mind to me is beautiful. So I would love to know how that mind gets, you know, triggered. I mean, I have to be honest with you. Um, <clears throat> well, like two of my favorite, like like uh, Larry David, George Carlin, Louis C.K. You know, before you know he became a chronic <laughs> masturbator. <laughs> that that kind of you know, those, those are you know, like kind of people I, they, because they're kind of push the boundaries. Anybody who's pushing boundaries, I, I love it. And to get it, to get inspired, I mean, you know, I, I write I write at least two songs a week, sometimes two songs and maybe uh, you know an editorial and a, a story time. And it's you know I've been doing that. I, I had to ramp it up now because it's all me. So I I do that every week. And it you know some Mondays I'll sit down and go, all right, what do you got for this week? Nothing. So I gotta go. I gotta go to the uh, to the medicinal cannabis, and then it just magically comes. It's it's a, it's never failed me. What what is your strain that you love? Um, free. <laughs> I get a lot of. I get, <laughs> I get a lot of free stuff still from like from that. People get you know how people are that that smoke. They're very generous. Oh yeah. But I like a you know uh and, and look I've been smoking for for thirty five years and I still can't get it right. I think sativa the one that that's more creative and energy that's the one right. Yeah, that's it. I mean, just give me some sativa, you know, and I'm good, man. I don't care what I, strain. It, it always works for me. I always. Like get that shit fucked up too. We have uh, weed shops out here. I'm not sure about if you guys have them back there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, yeah. I mean, about... we finally came into the you know the modern times down here in uh, Florida. We got weed shops. Oh fuck yeah! Well, I always look at you're not allowed to have your phone out in the weed shop, and I always forget like, oh shit, do I want? And they got sativa. So I have to look it up real fast and hide it. You're always yelling. Yeah. <laughs> but it's I, right. I mean, I I love going into a, the shop and some guys, you know selling just say hey try this it's great try this it's great it's clean and nice and everybody's friendly i love going to the dispensary it's fucking insane uh and then the last question is the last time you were inspired oh, inspired uh, that's a, i know that's a tough one i'm trying to think you see i've got you you finally stumped me i guess i'm not inspired very much <laughs> i mean Inspired to what? To write something? To uh, do something? To any inspiration that's ever, that hits you? When's the last time? Like, oh fuck! You know what I mean? Like, I mean, uh, you know, aha moment. That happens. I mean, it happens a lot. Nothing, you know, earth shattering. But you know, uh, I'm very fortunate. I haven't had writer's block since I've been fired, and uh, you know, I'll just be sitting around, and it just comes to me. I'm just, uh, I'm lucky. I'm very fortunate that I don't have to struggle. Because I've, you know, I mean, naturally there's been times in my career where I'm like, you know, I can't think of nothing funny. But it just, you know, I, I, I'm just a lucky guy. It comes to me. I mean, there would been, I would say there've been four or five times in my career where I went to Bubba and went, dude, I'm sorry, man. I mean, I'm working hard, but I got nothing for you. <laughs> this week was a bad week that you can't make funny. You can't make funny. But I, I haven't had that problem in a long time. I feel very fortunate. When when did that, when was the, like some time like and w were there like certain like subjects that he was like oh I need a song about this or on, on I, I, I didn't quite hear you what was that when you when you're getting that writer's block was there ever a time where you're like was it a certain subject or was it just a time in your life maybe it, I don't know I know I mean and it would never last for long I never you know. It's just sometimes you just can't make funny. <laughs> just it's you know to make funny. You know you're not a you stand up comedian. You just got to make you know something funny and create a bit out of nothing. And if nothing's going on, sometimes it just doesn't happen. You know, it, 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 I haven't had that problem in a long time, so I got my fingers crossed. Uh -huh.